This is a special video that I'm making for my YouTube subscribers because I know that many of you are Barry Manilow fans. And the reason I'm making this video is because I wanted to share a little bit of my Barry Manilow collection uh, with you. I have Barry Manilow Live. I bought this when I was young, very young, uh, probably 40 years ago when I was 10. I'm sorry for the glare from the light overhead, but that's lighting up the room. So I have Barry Manilow too. This one, I actually got this made into a CD so I could listen to this again. And it was very gratifying to be able to listen to this record again in the CD player in my car because I felt justified in saving it all these years because I have not had a record player in a long time. And yet I kept my records. I kept them for sentimental reasons. I kept them uh, for the same reason I keep a lot of stuff, which is I might need it someday. But in this case, I really did because my dormant, you know, obsession with him uh, was reawakened in May of 2013 and I fell back in love all over again um, with the newest version, and the, the older Barry, and dug these out from under the bed, which is literally where they had been for many years, and found a person who had a machine that could change these into CD, or record them into c CDs, so I could listen to them again. So um, I had that done with this one, Barry Manilow 2, and another one, which I can't, <laughs> shame on me. And then I'll show you this DVD. This was First in Farewell. Oh, and I have, um, I have close up too, but I'm not sure. I think there's something missing from this that I might have pulled out and I don't know. But this is first and first and farewell DVD. I'm no good at opening these. And then I this was the first um video DVD set that I bought when I when my passion was reignited. And this was I got a pretty good deal on this. This is five his first five television specials. Sort of a box set. <laughs> and I don't know, this was I think $20. I, I couldn't resist. Whatever the price was, it was such a Per, per CD or DVD, it was so low that, you know, I justified it. And I've watched them. I watched them when they were on TV. Are you kidding me? I But I have watched them and enjoyed them and don't regret any of these purchases. Now, I have a bunch of CDs, but they're out in my car. And my puppy goes nuts if I leave her. I, you know, she starts barking as soon as I leave the house, so um, I can't go get my CDs, but I'll tell you about them. I have Manilow Sing Sinatra. That's one of my all-time favorites. Singing with the big bands, uh, which I fast-forward through mm, a lot of. I fast-forward except for the singing, so, but I still like it. I like that DVD, that CD. Uh, I can't keep my technology straight. And, um, uh, <laughs> I don't know if I want to confess this, but whatever, shame on me. I got one out of the library. I think it was the greatest love songs of all time. Yes. And I recorded it onto a cassette so I could listen to it. And I, that's stealing. So yeah, come and get me. I, I'm sorry. I'm bad. Um, that's the greatest love songs of all time. And I had, I'm so mad at myself. I had uh, the, 
the greatest songs of the 60s. That was one of my favorites. And like a dummy, I left it in my car when I traded in my car in uh, 2014. I left that my beloved CD in the CD player and didn't realize it until weeks later and never saw it again. And I'm going to have to get another copy of the greatest um what is it called? The Greatest Songs of the 60s? Because that one has Cherish and Windy and um, ugh, the Elvis one and too many that I can't even think of that I love so, so, so much. Um, so what else? I have Even Now on CD that my sisters got me. It was the one with the two extra songs. They got me that as a birthday present and um, I don't know, I'm drawing a blank, but they're out in the car, and um, those are some of my other CDs. There's no Barry in there. It's Pink Floyd and Aerosmith, mostly. So that's a, a video of my collection, or part of it anyway, because I have so many subscribers, and you're really into Barry Manilow just like me. So um, that's all I have. Talk to you later. Bye.